All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another installment, or welcome to another installment of uh, Spartacus in Skyrim, where we uh, we're taking our dual wield orc warrior through the uh, through the old legendary difficulty of Skyrim, and we are currently where we left off. We are headed into Sarthal. We had a little bit of a tough time getting here. Had some fun with some bandits, but as you can see here, as we mine, we forgot. We forgot to re-equip after our selling. We forgot to re-equip our Talos gem or neck. And we forgot to re-equip our, our light armor headpiece. Now, the difference between the two is a over 100 armor because of all the extra bonuses we've got out of the uh, the light armor tree. Like, we, we go from 318 to 418. Now, when if the cap's really only, it's, it's only like 567 or 584, so 100 armor is almost one-fifth of that. So here we're uh we're gonna try to start up Sarthal here and see if we can't get through this. Yes, Tolf dear, it is always better to be cautious. Please lead on. Show us the way of safety in a dark crypt. Hmm. We've got our fellow students here. Yeah, I don't. I'm not so sure about you either. We also this, this particular crypt actually has some decent uh, stuff in it for us, um, like these leather strips and whatnot. Uh, so we're just gonna let them kind of do their thing, talk through it, and uh, and loot up as much as we can. I think we have a conversation with this guy coming up here down at the bottom. Magics that an early civilization used, huh? That's what we're here for. I feel like... Yeah. Please be careful here. We're gonna have lots of other things. I don't have any more questions for you. Alright. Arneal Grain. Apparently we got the special assignment. We've been treated pretty special since we showed up. We stayed quiet, the teacher asked us to help her demonstrate, he asked us our opinion of what we should do, it's all been, it's all been good for us. Let's see what's in this urn, shall we? Some gold, that's good. Oh, I hope I didn't lock myself in somewhere. There we go. Ooh, I was worried I'd have to start reloading already. Got some Namira's rod in here. What do you got here? Sack of stuff. Quicksilver ore. Ooh, is there Quicksilver in here? Where is it? Where is it? I haven't seen any. Pull out our torch. Make it easier to see if it's here. No. It lied to me. Hmm. Well, at least we got that much. Alright. What's up, Arneal? You must be. I've only looked through a portion of the sector. Try and be careful, alright? I'm always careful. Round up the rest of the magical artifacts so that I can catalog them. Okay, you're a cataloger. Cataloger of artifacts, I got you. It's hard to see that ring, but thankfully we've got this, you know, this, this arrow that tells us exactly where it's at. An embalming tool? I don't need to keep an embalming tool on me. Not trying to do that. Not Egyptian. Not trying to, not trying to mummify somebody. There's another ring, and then of course. Oh no! Oh no! But we're gonna we're gonna skip his his uh his talk. Just put the old amulet on. Equip our. Let's do flames. 
That's open. Yeah, must be. Must be. Let's uh, let's try to speed this up, shall we, there, old man? Mm, it's not that unusual, that unusual or interesting. So here we have to actually wait for him to. Unfortunately, we have to wait for him to finish his walk before we can get into the the meat. There we go. Hold, mage, and listen well. Know that you have set in motion a chain of events that cannot be stopped. Hmm. Judgment has not been passed, as you had no way of knowing. Judgment will be passed on your actions to come, and how you deal with the dangers ahead of you. Don't know why you think you can judge me. Okay, all right. The order's watching me. I, what just happened? Uh, some, somebody talked to me. He's a ghostly, said he's part of the Sigic Order, and that I'm supposed to save everybody, or, or I'm the only one who could affect things. Okay. Yeah, I'll be careful. I'm not the one you gotta worry about. Oh dear, you be quiet. You don't tell me to watch it. I'm the one killing things. Well, let's go ahead, just for good measure, we're going to make sure that we've got some food going. They're all vegetable soup rolling. For that stamina, that stamina regen. We also want to look for hanging moss in these crypts. Because we, hanging moss, it's I believe it's hanging moss, glow dust, and glowing mushroom. Those are great. Did you watch it with those flames there, uh, Tolf Deer? I'm uh, I'm not particularly a fan of flames. You haven't been in many Nordic ruins, apparently. Why, just the other day, I I had uh, a whole bunch of these guys pop out and uh, you know fight me in waves. I had to get a fragment of Wuthrod. It was a, it was quite the thing. Now, since you since you asked so nicely, I'm, I'll go ahead and go forward. <clears throat> the old man would like to look at these ruins and take them in, take in the sights. Almost thought that was a shield. It's a plate, just upside down. What else we got? Just some more gold, just looting away. We're up to 2,900 gold. That's good. Oh, yeah. What do we got here? I think we got some, uh, these guys. Oh, you only know, four hits for a Draugr? If I remember right, yeah, we, we leveled up on our way here with the archery. Um, I think we still need to go back and, uh, level that up, per se. Or level up, or purchase our enchanting. Let's do this. Now what? Let's see who else is here. No death lord. go and he had a elven bow 
We're actually going to pick that up because I think uh, because of our upgrade capacity, um, it'd be nicer, I think, if it was a glass bow. But because of our upgrade capacity, we should be able to, I think, upgrade that elven bow beyond what this orc bow is. Plus, we're in an elven art. We're in full elven armor with an elven sword. Why wouldn't we? Oh no. What did I pick up? Ancient Nord something. A war axe? I was trying to get trying to get the alchemy ingredients and you gave me a war axe. Alright, so let's see where we're at. Got some stuff to pick up here. Steel dagger to take, because we'll go enchant that later. Elven Gilded Armor of Recuperation. That I don't think we have the stamina regen yet. And since it's gilded, we could potentially upgrade it. Let's see what the uh, what the difference is between our current gilded armor and this one. So 418 to 359. I'm not willing to sacrifice that. But on the plus side, we know we have it and we can use some, uh, some Quicksilver Ore or Quicksilver Ingots to uh, upgrade it once we get the arcane smithing perk what do we got there just a skull okay all right all right what do we got left here we got some, some crypt stuff here we killed some dragorites oh we've got some blister wart oh there we are hanging moss love the hanging moss got us a trap There's that glass bow we were talking about. Oh, good lord, boys. We are in business. We're gonna go ahead and give this a... Oh, goodness gracious. Well, this is certainly going well for us. Uh, I did, I believe, miss, misspeak in the last video um, about the, you know, the amulet or the, the Talos. I think I claimed that I could potentially get it in solitude during our, um, or not the amulet, the blessing of Talos, that I could potentially get it in solitude with my, um, um, the other thing, yeah, with my uh, loop of, my selling loop. And uh, that is not true. It doesn't exist there. We have to like either go to the tal uh, the shrine of Talos or um, craft a, a one in our in our basement. So we may do that. Um, here you want to look at the one behind it. Uh, if that wasn't already uh, kind of you know obvious, it's uh, that one just shows whatever it is, whatever that specific piece is supposed to be. They're not hooked together. They're not linked together. They don't move together. So it's it's pretty much just you know twist and match. Well, I believe we have a, another guy he's going to pop out over there so we're going to go ahead and uh, rush him. An ebony warhammer. Nice, 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 nice. We are cooking with gas, boys. When we get that, uh, those, those power attacks just chaining across, we, uh, we, diff we dish out a lot of damage. And we don't even, you know, there are, there are some other things, right? We're, we're not at what I would consider full power, or even, like, what our best could be for this, uh, current level, just because we have, uh, and we haven't done, we focused a lot during the, uh, the whole walkthrough on getting combat in rather than, you know, getting our smithing up or, or vice versa. Let's see, we need sparks. Okay. So for these, um, for these darned mage quests, we're gonna, we're gonna do that. Let's see, illusion, alteration, destruction. And we'll put these on our put flames and sparks we don't have frost that's okay um, we'll put them on our, our quick our quick menu 
There we go. I think there's another one. There we go. And we gotta be real careful with that, because uh, those are like one shot us. Look at all this. Look at all this great gear. Alright, now this one they're attached. Um, I'm not sure if there's like a set order that it works uh, every time or if you start there, but. There we go. Oh, that was fast. Oh, well, whatever that was. Do that. Oh man, he said hold on. He's gonna come on here. We're not gonna use the alchemy lab. I believe that's an alchemy book. Um, he's gonna step on that darn trip. Cause he's real good at it. And he's decided that uh, we should we should have some some accompaniment. And here we are. It's it's uh it's the business time. So we're gonna let him talk to him. He's gonna complain that he's not doing any damage to him. And then after that, he's going to go suck, I believe, to, you know, try to, yeah. You drain some of its power. Go over to the Sarthal thing. And he's going to try and basically, I don't know what he's doing. But he, uh, he somehow takes the, the shield down. And with Berserk, we can actually kill him in ro one rotation. Normally, you I, I believe you have to um, hit him, do damage to him, and then wait, and then hit him and do damage to him, and then wait, and hit him and do damage to him, because that shield goes up over and over again. But because, uh, because of the amount of damage that we're putting out when we've got all these buffs up, we're good to go. This is simply... What is this thing? You don't know what it is? Yeah, I could do that. I could talk to him. There's a staff. We don't need that either, but we'll pick it up. And he wants us to go talk to the old Archmage. So we will plan on that. What do we got in here? Flawless rubies, a ring of mending, Re health regeneration. That's good for us as well. Two elven maces, a staff of frenzy. That. And we'll pick up these elven maces just because we can upgrade them. Um, helps with our smithing, and then we can drop them off at uh, you know to somebody, or we can just sell them if they're if, if we have enough money. Or we'll drop things like that when uh, if ever we get into weight problems. But. We should be good. We're done with this one. And now, we just got a... Um, we just recently walked here, so we'll hop over to the, uh, the Winterhold College. To deliver old Tolfdir's message from, from Sarthal, that there's a big, glowy, curious thing that we don't know what is. We got more snowberries here? No. No. We put our weapons away. May just may just get real offended with all these weapons. Oh, looks like we need to go to his quarters to do it. They were locked earlier. We weren't able to talk to him before. Yeah, so we have almost 3,300 gold, so I think we have enough to pay for our next... Uh, Enchanting levels, so we'll go find um, 
I think it's Phineas. No, sir. Sir, <laughs> I am Savos Arin. Ar I am quite con, but I do not and will. Well, be clear. I I guess sure. I don't um dangerous research. Yeah. yeah. What about Sarthal? That another one of the apprentices has been incinerated. I have enough to deal with right now. Incinerated apprentices? Nope. Nope. I found something else. I'm better than them. Uh. Found something. Tolfdeer well. thinks it's important. Trust that you wouldn't be here. Well, thank You're right. You for this to my <coughs> normally looks at, since he's apparently occupied, and I will need to see this discovery for myself. I think perhaps you should begin researching the subject. Speak with Urog in the Arcanium. See if he's aware of anything that matches your discovery. Deal. And good work. The next time you find yourself exploring Nordic ruins, perhaps this will be helpful. Well, thanks. Uh, do you think I could use the enchanter? Because, um, I've got a lot of weight, and I'm overweight now. Can I get... Oh, all I got is this ring? Uh, that's not... That's not gonna get me... Get me that weight off, boys. I need to run. Look at the belly. Oh, no. Can I... I wonder if I can pick all of these. I think it counts as stealing. Yep. It does. So let's go. He wants us to go to um, the book guy, I believe. It takes us to the Arcanium. And the book boy. And by book boy, I mean orc librarian that likes books you are now in the arcanium disrupt my arc now do you require assistance i do i need some books is there uh i need to learn about sarfa i know what you want well you don't even need to ask no i don't have anything for you not anymore anyway I why not anymore. you're the collector of knowledge volumes may have had some relevant information if you want them you'll have to talk to orthorn Oh, he stole them? Terrific. Happily, happily would I deal with somebody who has stolen books. You there, I have questions for you. You were in Sarfo, yes? It has come to my attention that something was found there. I don't care what you are. You're a Thalmor. You're gross. I know full well that you have. Please do not insult my intelligence. Well, is still there now, isn't he? you could find out yourself. When he returns. Why does it matter? Was discovered in Sarfo that was significant enough that Tolfdir sent a new member of the college alone to deliver work. That sounds precisely like the sort of thing that should matter to everyone, especially to me. Thank you for Especially your you? You're not, sp you're not special. You're just a pompous, arrogant, Thalmor high elf. Thing. I have many important things on my mind. Oh, go away. I wasn't even talking to you. I didn't even strike at you. I went down, you went up, and you still thought I was... Still thought you were important. Oh, I pulled those back. Uh-huh. Dangerous? That could have been dangerous if somebody just, like, just walked in. Ooh. Let's see if we can find old Finnis. I think he's over here. Finnis, teach me, teach me to, uh, not to Dougie, but to uh, enchant. I have gold for you. I will pay you to do so. Is that my bed? Couldn't tell you if it was my bed, but these are some alchemy meat ingredients I'm not going to pass up. Hmm. 
Well, there's people. Where are you? Are you up there? Hmm. I really need to sell some stuff. Hopefully. What about these alchemy ingredients? Are these also considered stealing? There's a giant's toe. You, you can see me? Yeah, of course I can. I why could I feed on that guy? Oh, because I'm a vampire as well. Okay. Whoo. Confound it all! I was quite sure I was invisible, or at least transparent. What have you got for sale? Incantations for those with the talent to cast them. Will you take these staffs? Please? Well, you only have 28 gold. Do you have any spells that I need? Fear, Fury, Muffle, Calm. What about Apparel? That's Illusion stuff. I'm not sure if I have any, so I'll just take this that super expensive one. How about these ones? There we go. We'll see if uh we'll see how that goes. The um the other thing is it, with these if you get robes of illusion or anything like that, robes of destruction or anything that has those um typically you don't want to get the ones that have this where it goes illusion and the magic of regen. Um you can if you're after, you know, it's better early. So like um if you're trying to power level early, then and you want that regen you can do that it's a little weird because you could just wait for the hour and have all the um, magicka back so that's a little counterproductive and, and you could probably get more if you're just specifically power leveling if you're trying to level while doing combat then definitely get the regen um additionally the if you get just the pure like destruction spells call le cost less or the 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 spell type costs less you'll get more percentage of cost less out of that enchant than the one that has the cost less and the magic regen so let's see we bought that so now he should take both of those and you can have all these rings i just got those and you can have these rubs of restoration there we go and you can have this scroll of firestorm. I don't want that either. But you can't have any of my gems. Those are mine. Thank you. Now I can run. So now we can try to hunt down Mr. Finnis. Is it Finnis Guineor? Potatoes. Need those for our soup. That's Sergius. Oh, what's this guy? Oh, that's Sergius. I've, I was wrong. There we go. So, um, he's already trained us for this level. So we'll go ahead and level up. I'm going to put that point into health as normal. And we're going to purchase our, uh, our five from him. There we go. We still have 1,100 gold. No, uh... No jump there. That's good. And so our... What is our enchanting at? Our enchanting is now at 46, which is good for us. We've got the one perk. Um, we're close to 90. So we're almost ready for this... Uh, this last, uh, last point. And what else do we have? We have the alchemy, but we're not quite right. We actually don't have the skill yet for that one. Restoration, then. That's, that is what we're going for. Um, we also want to get our alteration, but we will we'll power that up as much, uh, or potentially here in a bit. Um, we could get arcane smithing if we want to... Uh, Increase some of the, like the um, thieves guild armor and stuff like that. But what we we are cruising as fast as we can um, for necromage, if at all possible. So we'll get regeneration to help out our um, heals. That'll and we'll get respite and necromage. And those 
while those are the only things we need, you know, if you really wanted to have some extra, you could have recovery and uh, avoid death if you um, if you wanted to. But yeah, so we're gonna we're gonna go with restoration, get up to that, uh, get up to the necromage perk, because uh, that's really gonna help us take off in that uh, um, in that uh, sense or in that uh, scenario. We want it for uh, the way it works with vampires. That's what we. Want. That's why we want it. Restoration is a. You Hello, Colette. Restoration a valid school of. Of course, it's good. valid. Not that I. Re it can make life difficult. When what have you got for sale? Do you have anything bigger that uh, I don't have already? Like there's fast heals. Do you have? Oh, you have close wounds. Yeah. We're going to pay for that. And now we are out of, uh, of gold, essentially. But that, uh, this one, if we can, if we can do it, here's, uh, we'll see if we, I don't know if we even have enough Magicka. Um, let's see if we can, restoration, can we even... Do it. And we can do it once. So that is double. So it's fast healing, but double as much. Um, I think it costs, let's see, math wise. Close wounds cost 94. Fast healing costs 55. We get a double the healing. So for less, it, it's more efficient. It's significantly more efficient. But it's also off, almost a it's 150, and it's my it's our full mana bar. So if we're not taking damage, um, you know, if we're if we're taking small amounts of damage, we we would have to be lower for this to be effective. But for healing just in and of itself, this this will work out great. So we'll uh we'll leave the fast healing on there, and we're just gonna put close wounds on our our bar for that. All right. Well, that uh, concludes Sarthal. Uh, we uh, will find the fence. Mr. Enther, I believe he's in the other section. Uh, she's destruction. That's that's for all the. Um, we're gonna sell off some items over here, I believe. But that'll that'll do it for now. We've gotten the Sarthal thing. We've gotten all of that. Um, we've got to go hunt down some guy who stole. Stole some books from the library. Apparently they have a very, very strict return policy. And, uh... Oh yeah, is this ours? Look at that. They're just... Just mats. Just, just, just love it. Love, love the alchemy mats. Um, the other... The Mages College is really a good place to go, and if you when you finish this, it's actually a really good thing if you're doing uh, alchemy like we are. We uh, we built most of ours, but if you wanted to do it on the cheap or you were doing a nomad build, you could come up here. So let's see if Enter's here at his place. We'll uh, so we can sell. That's Mirabelle. Um. There's Enter. There are some Let's do some business. I do. I, I've got coin, but I'm trying to take your coin, actually. You still have the Daedra Hearts. That's nice. Um, but I want you to take some... How about an Ebony Warhammer? How about even more so? Let's put on our selling gear and just remember to put take it off and when we go for combat. As if you're going to need live chess subjects for your experiment, I hope you've got some coin. Well, let's just take a look. Then. I love it. There's, if you need live test subjects, you're going to need somewhere else to go or somewhere quiet. All right, so let's see. In apparel, do you have anything for... No, you don't have anything for smithing. You've just got these staffs. Okay, well, you can take this Warhammer. Oh, that would tr drain you of gold? Fine. 
Take these maces instead. Yeah. And apparel. Um, I'm not giving you the elven gauntlets because I've got these elven light gauntlets and I believe these will scale better. Um, you can have these orcus gauntlets. I don't care about those. Potions? No, no. Keeping most of these, even though there's a bunch of them. Food, ingredients, books, miscellaneous. You have I have dragon bones on me. You can have that. And you can have that dragon scale. There we go. All right, then. Now we shouldn't weigh so much. They, yeah, we dropped a lot of weight. Perfect. Well, that'll end it for today. Thanks for coming. Thanks for watching the video. If you're a fan of the series, or if you like what you see, like and subscribe, and we will uh, catch you at the next video.